protein just yeah. for interest. Yeah, yeah. And this can be whatever you're eating. You know, or you can cook up a, a half a chicken breast and it'll last a week in, in a Tupperware in the, in the fridge or something. But yeah, I mean, if you're having fish, you're having steak, you're having whatever, grab some tight little pieces, sprinkle it on the kibble, and put it down with their food, and wham. And yet, they're still eating the same food. Right, right. So. Excuse me. Uh -huh. So that's bite inhibition. The last two weeks, that's the biggest thing that they learned is bite inhibition. If one of them bites the other, the other one screams and stops playing with the one biting them. And that's how they learn. So if you get nibbled on and it hurts, you go, ow, and you stop playing. They turn away and stop playing. And they get that. That's exactly what just happened. House training. So we've begun the process. They're pretty good at using the pads. And of course, they'll go inside if they're inside. In your case, you want them to use the pads. You're in the park. Yeah, pads, yeah, for now. And then they're, when they can go outside and hold it to get outside. Yeah, it, it, it's not a bad thing that they can use the pads. Yeah. You know, there are show dogs all, you know, their whole life they can use a pad. And, and especially if it's raining and miserable outside, I don't care if they don't go out, they'll use the pad. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> it's an odd one. 